Here is a super easy project for kids that they will love and the magic element is the most important part. Super fun and I hope you like it. Hello, I am Gina Nichols and I go by Teacher Gina that two of my beautiful little children named me. And this is my very first video that my brother Scotty is filming for me. And I am going to show you some very fun art, some very simple art to start that you can do with children. I'm a preschool art teacher and the children I work with are usually about three to five years old. So I hope you enjoy this. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so the first project we're going to do is a very simple one but a lot of fun for kids because it's sort of like magic. So we're gonna start with a white wax crayon. You can use a white pastel, you can use white chalk, and a piece of white paper. This is a little thicker than typing paper, or printer paper actually. And we're gonna let the children take the crayon and scribble, scrabble, scribble, scrabble, scribble, scrabble, however they wish, and they'll say, I don't see anything. And that's fine. We'll tell them the magic's gonna happen later. And if you have a child who's really little, like a little one-year-old, you might give them a crayon with a little bit of color. And that way, when they're drawing, they can kind of see what they're doing, and it's still a fun effect. But this is a little bit for the older kids. Okay, then we take our watercolors, and really you can use any kind of watercolors you have. A couple of different sets here. And I always like to offer children different sizes of brushes. I tell them you can have a little tiny one, a medium one, or a great big one. Sometimes they want to use all of them. And we'll start out with whatever color the child chooses. And you do a little painting and you say, magic, do you see some of those lines that you made? A little rinsey rinse, try a different color. It's okay if the paints get a little bit mixed. Wow, we're starting to see something shining through. Let's try a little bit of one of these. These are a little different. And you can also use liquid water color if you're not using one of these in a palette. And for the kids, this is just kind of a, a really fun thing to be able to know that they don't see the white on the white, but their scribble scrabbles do show up once they add a little color to it. Okay, so that's that side. We'll flip it over for our younger little ones. Let's use a little bit of a darker color. And voila this is wax resist because the wax is resisting the paint a masterpiece <laughs> really cool. okay now we'll show let me show just one other little thing you can experiment with different types of paper this is kind of a shiny photo paper so once again we take our crayon scribble scrabble draw a little picture let them do whatever they wish. And then let's use a little bigger brush this time. Sometimes the dark paint works a little bit better. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and we'll try a little pink. And maybe a little red. Wow, magic. Little ones love that. And here I will show you just a couple, this is on a little bit thicker cardboard that I used. And this is just playing around with the colors, a little scribble scrabble, rainbows you can do. This is kind of a little I love you. And this is watercolor paper. And this was one that I made using the crayon to write a word, scribble scribble, and then just a little color. And this is the same thing, and then just adding a little tissue heart, which I glued on. So there's all kinds of fun things that you can do with the very simple watercolor. 
And the idea of the magic for kids, very simple and very fun. Hope you liked my very first art video. If you would, please push the subscribe and you'll get future notices of any little art videos that I put up. And if you would like it and feel free to share. Thank you. Bye-bye.